Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome, my students, in a new practical exercise using HTML and CSS. In this assignment, we will talk about how to design my home page using the HTML code and CSS code. In this practical exercise, we will create or design the layout or create the page layout, header and footer, navigation pane, and the contents. Okay, then we, we will create a navigation panel, how to design the navigation panel, page one, page two, page three, and so on. Okay, we have more pages in our website, so I have to make navigation panel. Then we will create a section for every contents in the body of the page, in the contents div, like the following sample here. I have here header and footer. Here is a navigation panel. I add links here for the pages in my website. Then in the right side, we'll add the contents or the body of the page. Like what? Like text, paragraphs, titles, subtitles, heading, heading and so on, and pictures. Okay, and more. Now let's go to start our practical assignment. Now start the page layout. Okay, here open folder. That's my folder, and I create folder now for the current project home page. Okay, that is my folder. Double click, open the folder now, then select folder. As you see now, I have I have here the home page. This is my folder. Add the first page or the first HTML page here under title my home page dot HTML. Then create the basic element inside the page. Right doc, enter here's the basic element, HTML tag, head and body. Okay, here write in the title tag my page or home page. Yeah. I need four devs. I need four devs. Header, footer, navigation panel, and the contents. Okay. Now, the first tag here, the header, header, okay, is the first tag, and the last tag here, the footer, okay, and the header can write my home page, my home page, okay. And the footer, okay. I can write, for example, formal website, okay. And the copyright and under right copy, yes. Then the can't academic here dash two thousand twenty two. Now display the page and see the result. My home page is the header and this is a footer. Okay, but without height, without width, without background color. To distinguish between them, I have add the width and height and background color to see the result. Width, height, background color is a CSS code. Okay, here inside the header opening tag here, add style, for example, between double quotation, right here, background color, we distinguish black, for example, then the height, for example, 
250 pixel and the width for 100 percent is suitable for the width of the page okay the same thing Control C and Control V here for the footer and see the result. This is the header and the footer, but I have to change the text inside every one. Okay. Here and a color white, for example. Here also the same color. Okay, now refresh the page here my home page and formal website. Okay, I need to increase the header text and also the footer text. Okay, to make like this, I have to add H1 and H1 in every div, header and footer. Okay, here. It is the header tag. Any side header tag here, I add my home page inside H1. H1 tag, yes, and write my home page inside it like this. The same thing for the formal or the footer here, formal website, and H1 also. Like this. See the result. This is a home page as a header and formal website here as a footer. Okay. But we need add we need to add now the div one and div two, the contents and the navigation panel. As you see in the picture, navigation panel in the left side and the contents in the right side. Okay, here, back to the code. Between the header and the footer, add to div, div multiplication two, yeah. I have to div now. Number one is navigation panel. Add each one here. H1 Okay, then write Navigation panel, okay, and here is the contents Okay, now display to see the result. Refresh now is navigation panel and here contents. Okay, for the contents also between H1 tag, H1 tag, yeah, control V. Okay, I need navigation panel in the left side and contents in the right side. The property in the CSS in the CSS code which is responsible for this effects is the float property. Float property. Okay, now the navigation panel in the left side and the direction from left to right. Okay, so I'll add a float property with the value left. Okay, now float left for the navigation panel number one and float equal left also for navigation panel number for the contents 
is the div number two. Okay, here, back to the cool. Div number one, add a style, okay, okay, add a width, for example, 25%. 25, 100%, okay, and height, for example, make it 300 pixel, okay, I can increase it to, okay, then add the important property here, float, and the value equal lift, okay, here, and the contents div I add a style with width seventy five hundred percent and the height the same height for example three hundred pixel I can increase it also okay float equal lift now see the result, refresh the page now, it is number one and number two, okay, and a background color here for everyone, background color, like the yellow color, and for the contents background color, for example, blue or light blue, I can edit the color from here, for example, yeah, okay, now refresh the page to see the result, it is navigation panel and contents, I can't see now the footer, I can't see the footer, by default, the footer now, I have to edit the float property edit the float property float left instead of float left I add here clear the flow please okay stop this effects to stop the float effects now I add clear then add clear left okay clear left please stop the float left by adding clear left for the last tag here, footer. Okay, F clear left. Okay, back to the page now. Refresh the page to see the result as you see. Is the header, footer, navigation panel, and the contents. Okay. Now we have finished the first objective in our practical assignment, how to design the page layout, okay? You can add some properties to uh, header and footer and div number one navigation panel and div number two, the contents up to you, okay? As you see here, the height, for example, is 300 pixel, is the height. 300 pixel for the navigation panel and contents. I can increase it instead of uh, 300. I can it make it six, uh, 600 here also. 600. Okay. Refresh the page. Now I increase the height for every div. Navigation panel and contents. Also, I can edit the width. Here the width. 200%, 20 hundred percent, twenty twenty five uh, sorry twenty five hundred percent from the page, from the page. I can increase it. For example, as you see here, fifty and here, fifty hundred percent. Okay, now navigation panel width equal content width. Okay, but almost time. I want to. Navigation panel width less than the contents width here 25 and here 
7500%. Okay, sorry, remove pixel. Yes, that's right. Now rephrase the page. Okay, now we learn how to make the page layout. And it was the first objective how to design, how, how to add a layout, different layout in my home, to my home page. Thank you.